Meanwhile, CAF President uh, Patrice Musipe visited the Ghana national football team yesterday as they prepared for their opening World Cup clash against Portugal today. In his visit, Musipe had the opportunity to address the Black Stars ahead of the must-win encounter at Stadium 974. Newsroom Africa's Khotso Silo was pre present at the briefing and has more. CAF President Patrice Musipe dropped by a team Ghana's base camp here at Al Saad in Doha. Mutsepe was his charismatic self, dropping pearls of wisdom and some sage advice. What, what Pele said many years ago that by the year 2000, an African team, a nation from Africa, will be uh, champions of the world. We, we proceed. If somebody as great as Pele uh, believes in that, we are absolutely in good company and we are confident in our own right that uh, part of what we're doing now and what we've done is to build towards that process of uh, realizing this objective of an African nation uh, being champions, champions of the world. And uh, I was talking about Ghana in 2010. They, they did exceptionally well and they made us all very proud. And this team is going to make us very, very proud. Mutsipa further reminded the Ghanaians that the entire continent is behind them. When every nation from the continent plays in the World Cup, they, they, they represent all of us. They represent the 1.4 billion people on the African continent and the 54 nations that are part of CAF and on the continent. So, uh, and, and that's why I, you know, when I met with the head of state, uh, I, I did say that I am I'm very proud of the leadership that CAF is providing because Leadership is very important, the inspiration, the hard work, the motivation and also putting the interests of the players, of the technical team, of the nation, of the people of Ghana and for us uh, uh, making the people of Ghana proud but also the whole of the continent very proud. Ghana take on a Cristiano Ronaldo led Portugal side in their first match of the tournament. For Newsroom Africa on Channel 405, I am Hotosello in Doha.